Here we have a Neckville Diamond Joe model, which is also known as the Sonny Smith model. Sonny uh, won uh, Winfield Banjo Contest, one of many, and uh, let's hear what it sounds like. <laughs> That's why it sounded a little strange, but the uh, purpose of this is so you can hear the way the banjo sounds, which is incredible. This is an unbelievable banjo, and we have a certificate signed by Sonny Smith uh, that says that he owns it, and it was also so the first of the Diamond Joes to be made, and we'll show you in a second what the Diamond Joe means, but you can see it has the Neckville tailpiece. Uh, you read up about Neckville, it has two wrenches with it, which lets you adjust the uh, the tension of the head very quickly. And uh, it's it's really great if you're messing around with your banjo, because instead of having to turn 24 uh, lugs, you just turn these two wrenches, and it's, all, it's even, it's perfect. And let's look at the workmanship on this Diamond Joe. Uh, as, as we go up the uh, neck, you do see this thing that says Hill Amount right here. Diamond Joe, and then look at the beautiful inlay. Has a radius fingerboard. Now, if you play uh, melodic styles or single single string, Noam Bikilny, Bela Fleck, uh, Tony Trishka, Bill Keith, people like that, you'll like the radius fingerboard. It makes, makes some difference. Also, you'll notice there's no fifth string on this banjo. So as you're going up and down the neck, you're not having to adjust for that fifth string. So that, that makes it uh, really convenient. And then I'm gonna turn the banjo over and you're gonna see that it is a beautiful curly maple banjo. Okay, got the light in there. And we'll go up the neck. And you will see in a minute when I turn it to the side and here it comes, look at the inlay. I'm not the inlay, but the binding. It has little diamonds inlaid into it as you go up the neck, all over the place. We're talking the resonator. You come down and see the side of the resonator, and you see these little diamonds, and that's why they call it Diamond Joe, okay? That's really cool. Um, wonderful condition, wonderful sounding banjo, rare banjo being the first one, neck fill, and uh, once again, uh, this banjo is very reasonably priced. Uh, give us a call at 404-372-5482, or you can go to the Banjo Warehouse. Incidentally, I'm just uh, suggesting that you might want to subscribe to this channel, and then whenever we come up with a new banjo, you'll get a notification, and uh, it'll help to with your banjo fix, because once you get into banjos, it's amazing. You want to see banjos all the time. If you want to see some banjos, compare banjos. I've uh, got about 70 used ones. Just uh, come to our location in East Point, Atlanta. You can fly in. We're seven minutes from the airport, uh, and, and that's pretty much it. So uh, give us a call, but if you do go, come to visit, give us a day's notice at least, or if you're flying in, call us before you book your flight. We're here almost every day, but sometimes we're out buying banjos. So that's it. So uh, you guys have a nice day, and we'll be happy to see you.